Furion. I must protect the wild. I will fight with honor. Oh my god. So much honor going on. We're against unknown the druid. See ya, see ya, see ya. I haven't felt this acolyte of pain do much. Alright. That's all I'm feeling right now, man. I'm feeling so hyped. <laughs> Okay, uh, let me just say the uh, two best video game soundtracks that you may not have heard of are Toe Jam and Earl, one of the greatest games of all time. Oh my god, we gotta talk about Toe Jam and Earl in part three, holy shit! Okay, um, oh, Maytel giving me compliments on my typing speed? Oh my god, let me tell you, I type. I can type, man. And let me tell you, you know what's a button I don't hit? That backspace ever. Nope. You want me to hit backspace? No. Back off. Um, okay, second great game soundtrack, Hunter Hunted. Toe Jam and Earl, Hunter Hunted. Remember. Okay, so I'm going to do some combination of stuff. I can play this, play this, kill that. Hmm. Um, of course, I know. I already know in advance that he has Force of Nature, Savage Groa. I can play this and see. Um, Follow the rule. Go like this. I did this in the wrong order. And I, just, sh 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 <laughs> don't. Nope. We're not gonna talk about it. Okay, let me tell you about Toe Jam and Earl. Because Toe Jam and Earl is the story of two highly funky aliens from the planet Funkatron. And they're cruising through the galaxy in their rap ma or what is the rap master rocket or whatever it is. And uh, and then they crash on Earth, which is the craziest planet of all that they've ever seen. And they have to collect these pieces to their rocket ship and get the hell out of there. So the way it works is the level is uh, it's a it's a flat level, it's an isometric platform. And you wander around, and there's no combat, you don't jump on things, there's just enemies you have to avoid. And if they hit you, your little meter goes down. And the mechanic in the game, the core mechanic, is presence. You'll see a little presence on the ground, like a Christmas present. And you'll pick it up. And you go to your inventory, and then listed there is the present. And you, you, don't, know what, you don't know what's inside of it. So you just open it and see. And the presents are huge varieties of things. You can get tomatoes. You can throw at enemies to kill them. You can, uh, like, summon a tornado. And the tornado will start just, like, moving all around, like, hurting you and everyone else. Um, you can equip rockets on your feet. You just be shooting off at the speed of light. Uh, I think I'm going to do... And then I just trade, right? Seems good. So, you don't know what's in the presence. I mean, sometimes you'll just open it and you'll you'll instantly die. So it's complete random garbage. It's awesome. So once you've opened the present, if you find the same present, then you can... You, then you know what it is. Um, shall I oh, wait, this sucks a lot of ass, man. This is bad. I don't know, I guess I'll get a full cost minion out of this. Boom! Ship the Oasis Snap Jaws. Booyah! It's so fun. There is no game even remotely like it. So you wander through this level, and you are looking for the ship piece that's on that level, or if there's no ship piece, there's an elevator. And when you get in the elevator, it just takes you up to the next level, right? It literally takes it to the next level, all right? You know, very meta game stuff. It was very common back in the day. So, um, 
so it, 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 on the 2D platform, if you fall off the edge, you fall down to the previous level. So I can go hit, 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 and I like this. I don't think they're... Oh, well, they are running Dr. Dr. Boom. So I think I'm gonna hit like this. I'm gonna hit like this. I'm gonna still have health left over, because I'm the best. Uh, I think I avoid him, is that right? I have a lot of health gain. I think I do want to do this. It's one of the greatest games. Yeah, so like you can, uh, yeah, if you're playing two player, you can like get special items to like join join your friend and stuff. If you've fallen down a lot. Oh, oh, boom! Raptor time. So I can hit like this. I think I I think I am going to perform the thread. I'm gonna hold on to Mr. BGH. We're going to take a little damage there because I gotta lay on hands. The unemployed Shaku asks what happens if you fall off the first level. You go to level zero and it's a secret world. Isn't that cool? And you can actually swim to the top left of level zero. Or you can fly there, you have to have special presence to be able to get there. And if you go to the far top left, because level zero is all water, you can't go off the edge, it just seems to be endless water everywhere. But then you can get to fucking level zero, man. For justice. And for, you can get a level negative one, you get a level negative one if you fly to the corner and you can find the space. What, uh, Jason Mayans keep targeted by sponsor? Put your faith in the light. So cool! I loved those Easter eggs. Yeah, so so level zero is all water, except for a little island in the middle. But if you fly to the far top left of the game screen, there's a little pit and you can fall down that pit and you hit level negative one and there's a hot tub. I sound like I'm making this up, but there's, there's a hot tub and you can get in it. And there's hula girls in there and they talk to you. Not in a over-sexualized fashion. That's, much game media is uh, want to do lately, but in like an utterly ridiculous, silly fashion. That's hilarious. All right, we got him drawn. He's panicked. He knows. He knows something's wrong. He has an enough to black knight, but that's okay. I must safeguard the land. I must safeguard the land. Guess what? I'm a six six. I don't give a damn. Dun, 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 dun. What's in my bowl? It's water. I had a great day at work, which is what really energized me. Oh my god. Big Scanner says, is he talking about Hot Tub Time Machine game? Not a time machine game. It's, uh... God, I mean, the music in this game is so cool. Listen to this music. This is the music from the elevator. Hold on, check this out. Can you imagine two highly funky aliens rocking out to this? I gotta stream this game at some point. Hold on, hold on, hold on. All right, li listen, listen to this. Just sick funky beats. Oh my god. Oh, no, 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 no. How much is that? Shit. Four, four times. No, no, we're okay. Unless he innervates. Highly funky three-legged alien rocking out to this. Oh yes. Oh, actually, if this gets muted on YouTube, that would be really bad, wouldn't it? I don't think it will. It doesn't get muted on uh, on stream, which is why I play the song so much. Okay. Okay. Isn't that isn't that an amazing song? Down, 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 down. 
Unbelievable music. Dun -dun -dun. Tim Tara says, I was watching a game of tabletop with Will Wheaton. I love how you couldn't stop laughing. That happens a lot. <laughs> it, it lately hasn't. Like, my, my funny mojo has been a little off lately. I think I've been, like, so focused on, like, trying to stay focused at work. I've got the beast and when I feel a little mentally distracted, I'm like, body, no! You will do no such body. What to do? What to do? Um. Uh. Reporting for duty. See what happens. Get toasted. I like this play. God, that song is hype. Super hype. Uh-oh. Healing! Ooh, well that sucks. I just... Oh, shoot. Shitty crappy balls. Um, which is better? I think it's better if I do this. This. Yeah, he's gonna see that I did it in the wrong thing. Mm. Oh my god. Idle Satire says, I would buy a mostly walking bowl and fill it with mints. Ho 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 ho! I'm sure we got some new subs who are going on here. I must safeguard the land. Won't! Allows 305, what is up? Come on, hit me here, bruh. Dun, 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 dun. Going down to six. One, two, three, four, five. We're actually close to kind of losing a little momentum here. No, we're not. We won the damn game. Yet another game won with the one one. Up and away. This is one of these decks that I might want to grind a legend someday. Uther versus Gul'dan. I'm in a, I'm in a grand old mood, in a high flying mood. Fight with honor. And forever in peace shall I wave. Oh, we're against a warlock. Guess what? Consecration time. Beat unknown. We're up against unknown again. I don't know who he is. I don't know anything about him. Boy, do I want him to die. We have so many answers to big cards. I mean, running just the two Aldor peacekeepers. Boom! Send those giants back to 1-1 one, one town. 1-8 one, town. You know, you know, you understand what I'm talking about, though. You get, you get what I mean. Uh, I have a drift, and you can, uh, you can catch it. You can catch my drift. Guess what? I'm back! Back 20 hype! Big Skin says, Sean, will you do it? Will you make it to Legend this season? I can't, I can't. I got a full work week. And then Friday night, Case, aka Koyuki O, is coming all up in this town. And then Case, Tristan, and I... 
will be partaking in the Magic the Gathering Grand Prix San Jose Team Tournament! Whoa! That's gonna be great, let me tell you. Tristan and Case are gonna carry me hard. So hard. Oh, you think you're intimidating? Well, you are. Back off. Um... I'm gonna do this because I, I have my wombo combo in hand. Hey, but Justice said, is it, is it limited or constructed? Um, my, I believe that what it is is 12 packs of the most recent set. Uh, well, that, geez, that really puts a, that really stifles me. I think I'm just gonna do this and then I'm gonna pass because I got this little trick start here now. <laughs> Um, you get 12 packs from the most recent set, and you have to make three 40-card decks out of that. It's really good, because let me tell you, I, I think there are few deck builders, uh, including in Hearthstone, who are as good and flexible as, as Case. Uh, because there's not, there's not a terribly large amount of formats in Hearthstone, right? There's Constructed, which is, you know, Constructed. Uh, there's draft. Okay. Oh, it's six plus six packs. Okay. Um, uh, anyways. Um, but yeah, like, like, what makes Case an amazing deck builder is if you throw a twist at him, he will optimize that twist 95% of the way in, like, five minutes. Like, he made these sick decks in the ESL tournaments that we're running. Like, ESL has these tournaments that are... It's like, I mean, it's, it's like Fun Day Monday, but for Hearthstone, but serious, right? Where, make a deck where you must have two young brewmasters and two big brewmasters. Two big pandas and two little pandas. Youthful brewmasters and ancient brewmasters, that's right. Um, I feel we played suboptimally. Uh, okay, so I'm gonna do this. That's gonna clear that out. I'm gonna kill like this, and then I'm gonna kill like that. Okay. I'm not gonna run this puppy out. I've, I've got the beast in my sides. Um, yeah, so, so Case was, Case made just really, really solid decks out of that, like, instantly. Uh, Case is also a world champion at Legend of the Five Rings. Another uh, TCG. So many possibilities. So many possibilities. Uh oh. Ho ho ho. He's going to take a trip to see you later, Town Hard. S M I. Do I run this guy out right now? He can do that. Put your faith in the light. I like this. Keep a little board presence out. Dun, 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 dun. Peace out, Caramelizer. Play two more cards. Then I'll take them all. Oh, alright. This is fine. I actually am going to do this. I can play some more cards. I can mind control tech. Oh. Oh, oh, oh! Bingo! Andrew Sio says, I wish there was a way to set up a private Hearthstone tournament with rules. So Sean could play randomly against Day Knights. That would be amazing. That would be unbelievable. OMG. Alright, well, let's go ahead and run out. Oh! Oh! <laughs> uh, 
Oh god, Toe Jam and Earl's great. We're talking about Toe Jam and Earl. We were talking about... Yeah, Case Case is just a really sharp and brilliant guy. And the thing that frustrates me about Case is that he is so sharp and smart about deck building and being flexible in that way that when I give him really bad suggestions, things that as a sensei he should look at me and be like, No, dummy, don't. I have no time for games. Rather, he goes, I can see an argument for that. Like, consistently. I'm like, Case, no, don't. Stop it, Case. Case, stop it. I really wish he would have left all his dudes out. Well, we could send him to Battle Mustard Town. We have many Let choices. Think. Yeah, Case always sees things from other people's point of view. Oh yeah, I can understand why you might want to be running. A deck with no creatures as a My warlock. Shield for Argus. I completely understand that, Sean. I respect it. I understand it. And I want you to know that I appreciate everything about what you're saying to me. I'm like, God, thank you, Kate, for it's really thoughtful of you to be so considerate and considering of what I'm throwing down. And then I just get slain. Well, give me one. I think I'm gonna steal my piloted shredder back. That's what I'm thinking. And boom! Cuff! That's me snapping his neck onto his baby, man! Right over the man, like he's getting baptized in that. Bam! Oh my God, that was. Oh my God! What the hell of you just that? I just took a card in a fleeting game that's gonna last, what, it's lasted six minutes? That's it? To his baby, jeez. Wow, I should go to a doctor, get that checked out, or that should be added into the next Mortal Kombat game. Wow, we went topsy-turvy on a dime. Ugh. Whew. Okay, let's reevaluate everything that we are. Okay. Hmm. So I think I want to do a little tippy tappy here. So we got to be careful of dying. So I throw this one out, and then I can kill this. It's very unlikely it'll be able to kill this. Boom. I'm invincible. I'm invincible. For justice. And then we don't attack. That's what I want. Okay, this is this is okay. This is okay. Well, especially with that draw. We're in really good shape now. Okay, okay, okay. I'm gonna save that equality, man. I'm saving it. Ooh, 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 ooh. See, I didn't lose any of the quartermaster value. Why no attack with the Black Knight? Uh, because he can 
do whatever clearing stuff he needs to do and still have mana to get the Molten Giants out. That was the loudest clear ever. Back from the junk heap. Why don't you run out a single Molten? Back from the junk heap. Right, we didn't junk heap. I've got the beast in my sights. Uh, it beat it beat in the in the sights. Okay, let's see. Weapons ready. I see. The battle. I can't do that. Weapons ready. Justice. Oh. Yeah. 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 Nine mana hellfire. Five, six, seven, eight. Five, six, seven. Oh my god! Look at this! Look at this! Look at this! And okay, watch. And when it's healed, and deal one damage. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> oh, that's not that cool, but it feels cool. That's the thing. Uh, oh my god. Oh ho ho ho. Oh my god. Time to call everyone's favorite pizza store and order a Recaroni pizza. Oh my god. Oh, call the president. Tell him he's going to be reelected to a third term after the populace is led to his support by that play. Bam! Oh man, that feels great. Yeah, come here! And I will raise you up on kitty wings. Come here. I'm going to sing a hymn to your face. Yeah. Hey. Hey, I'm a sick Hearthstone player. Because I use the right decks. You're so cute. Jesus, you don't even understand how cute you are. Oh, she's purring. Oh, yeah. Oh, you're gonna get flipped upside down. Because it's kitty tummy time. Come here. Come here. Come here, let it be kitty tummy time. There it is. That's the way to celebrate. Alright, here, I'm gonna... Hold the cat by the microphone. Listen to that. That's that's me. That's me purring. Cause I'm so happy I won that game that way. This is really creepy. We just see just my mouth. Felt really nice. Wow. It's so impersonal the way it's just a mouth with no face. Ooh. Yeah. Oh. Oh, sheriff. Oh. Oh, sheriff. Is it time for sheriff kitty tummy time too? Here, Despy. Despy, come here. Nope, that's my water bowl. Well, don't know what I expected. Okay, okay, Despy. You're having a great time. I'm gonna put you on the floor. Okay. Okay, come here, Sheriff. Time for Sheriff Kitty Tummy Time. Come here. Come here. Nope, nope. Ow! Ow! <laughs> Ow! <laughs> oh, oh, I got one paw out. Oh, shit! Oh! <laughs> Hi, Sheriff. I'm sorry. I'm sorry I did that to you. Is that comfier? That must be a lot comfier. Well, we always want to end on a good note. So we're going to end it. I'll see you tomorrow. I'm going to also play Hearthstone.